Lipids in the digestive tract are emulsified by bile salts, lipases, then break down the lipids, and the products are absorbed into the enterocytes. With the help of microsomal triglyceride transfer protein, MTP, enterocytes resynthesize lipids and package them into chylomicrons with ApoB48, containing 48% protein coded by the ApoB gene. A part of the resynthesized lipids are stored as cytosolic lipid droplets. Chylomicrons are then released from the basolateral side and enter the general circulation through the thoracic duct. Free cholesterol is either excreted back into the intestinal lumen or into the bloodstream as HDL. The liver secretes VLDL and nascent HDL. The liver packs triglycerides, cholesterol, and other lipids into VLDL with the help of MTP with the protein ApoB100, containing 100% protein coded by the ApoB gene. Chylomicrons and VLDL take up ApoC2 and ApoE from HDL. Lipoprotein lipase, present in the capillary walls of adipose, muscle, and other tissues, is activated by ApoC2 and hydrolyzes a portion of triglycerides in chylomicrons and VLDL, converting them to chylomicron remnants and IDL, respectively. Chylomicron remnants are taken up by the liver. VLDL, which is converted to IDL, is further hydrolyzed by hepatic lipase to lose ApoE, forming LDL with lower triglyceride and higher cholesterol content. LDL supplies cholesterol to extrahepatic tissues. Remaining LDL is endocytosed by the liver. Meanwhile, the enzyme cholesterol ester transfer protein, CETP, transfers cholesterol esters from HDL to VLDL and LDL. The plasma enzyme lecithin cholesterol acyl transferase, LCAT, catalyzes the esterification of free cholesterol present in extrahepatic tissues and transfers it to HDL, scavenging peripheral tissue cholesterol. Matured HDL, rich in cholesterol, are endocytosed by liver hepatocytes.